A woman is locked up in the Marion County Jail tonight after she allegedly fired a gunshot at the appliance repairman who would not fix her clothes dryer. Rich Nye talked to that man this afternoon who left the dryer in pieces to run from the customer who refused to pay for his services. An appliance repairman came to this house Monday to diagnose a problem with the dryer, but he says the woman here didn't want to pay for the house call and pulled a gun on him to try to make him fix it for free. Nate Baird is self-employed, fixing home appliances and HVAC systems. Baird says he found out what was wrong with Reba Wilson's dryer, but she did not want him to fix it and refused to pay the $70 service fee. Baird says he tried to leave with her dryer in pieces, but says she blocked the front door and pointed a gun at him. Baird ran out the back door. He heard a gunshot, but got away, took off in his truck and called police. It just scared me. <laughs> I, I was just disturbed. I don't, I don't know. I've never even been threatened by a customer before. It was first for everything, I guess. Police say they found a shell casing sitting on a dryer door in the kitchen and a gun under the couch. Wilson faces five felony charges. She is a convicted felon, not allowed to have a gun. In Indianapolis, Rich Nye, 13 News. All right, thanks to Rich there. Wilson makes her initial court appearance on these charges tomorrow morning. Tonight at 6, what she allegedly yelled at Baird that makes him believe she was definitely trying to shoot him.